Yes. All right. Village, my apartment. Okay. There we go. Very nearly screwed that up. <sighs> oh, TMI. <laughs> All right. Okay, another peaceful spot. Okay, so I can't do the club quite yet. Uh Library. Like, I'm pretty sure this is the reading, like, I just, almost based on the fact that this is the, the big reading room from uh, Ghostbusters. All right. Actually, been... oh, medical student, at least. which is actually probably makes her a good spot to help. Okay, now she got her warming up to, to doing more fun stuff. Oh, I was like, also seeing the, the use of music here to tell what mood um, she's up for. And now we have to hang out with Gemini. Oh, well, not really. It's our neighborhood. Okay, so this is actually kind of the, the, the one that gives me a boost for both of them. Ah. 
<laughs> uh, the implication that that, that shit of course being here that, that shit is first love was a sad breakup and they're like oh Oh, Shin's a whoop. Ed Pats. Protagonist. All right. So, where does Diana want to go next? Okay, so we're still in a pretty upbeat tone mood. Let's do... Well, let's actually, now let's head back to the theater. Look, no, wait, no, wait, we're in the afternoon. There's the jazz club in Harlem. Um... Yep. Subaru is here now. Okay. All right. All right. <laughs> ah, ah, ah. Ah, Super is true. Super is trying to swoop her up. I'm not going to do the romantic, but let's do uh, cheerful. That's the same piano melody they do for the calm one, too. I, I, I tried it the calm one once before when I had the um, recording streaming session that did not complete for very the not using because of a video quality reason. All right. Okay, so we're in a good spot. All right, I think now I actually head to the theater. I need to submit a picture, my the photo to. Barry. All right. Um, Rosita putting up the ferret as a, a Uibozu. Um, 
Oh, okay. All right, and <laughs> oh. Okay. Sorry. All right. I also one thing I do like about the, the is the emulation here is with the uh, some of the, the picture crop quality on the graphical sequence. <laughs> Ignore me if you want to. <laughs> All right. Okay, let's do... Uh, I don't want to do the cheese one, but fine. All right. <clears throat> Okay. Okay, so both of her like her, her top two favorite plays of the tragedies. At least she'd go, oh, have the thing. like I kind of wanted like the rest of Reagan like, oh, my second Hamlet's my second favorite play are after Romeo and Juliet, then after Hamlet. I love Macbeth, and then King Lear, and then Julius Caesar, and then uh, Titus Andronicus. <laughs> like, just please to go through tragedy after tragedy after tragedy after tragedy. Like, um... <laughs> what about the, the comedies? Like, 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 um, Love's Labor Lost, and uh, Much Ado About Nothing. Oh, those are fine, but I, I think, like, Actually, I haven't read those. That don't read those. Or like I've never had a chance to see those ones. <laughs> All right. Okay. <laughs> Uh, oh, and time for the play.
All right. Okay, got got the the middle level, which is fine. I do kind of wonder if, if the fact that they went for, like, they mentioned that her favorite Shakespeare play is Romeo and Juliet. I do wonder if the fact they went, okay, we're going to have Hamlet be a musical because in IRL, they've already made Romeo and Juliet into a musical and an opera. But I think Hamlet, I know Hamlet's been adapted into an opera. Um... Don't know, but again, again, I don't know about a musical. Macbeth has also been an opera, um, and Macbeth. Don't know again, not a musical, not been adapted into musical. Was adapted in uh, Strange Brew, um, which I need. I'm I'm I I I'm, I'm going to say Okay, like seriously, like you know, I'm just going to I'm going to bring this up right now cuz they're like it's pretty clear cut having Turn a couple times to get it. That that it's not about just what do you do with this time with your time allotted. It's quite clearly about whether or not you kill yourself to commit suicide. It's how much contemplating suicide. Like the line is. I'm bringing this up to make sure I get this correct. Um. From the, from the soliloquy. Um, like, like, like you, you, you just like stopped right short between the part that makes us clear to be or not to be. That is the question, whether it is nobler in the mind to suffer the slings and arrows of outrageous fortunes or, or to take arms against the sea of troubles and by opposing end them to die, to sleep no more. And by a sleep, we, we. Uh, to say we end the heartache and a thousand natural shocks that flesh is heir to is a consummation devoutly to be wished. Die to sleep, to sleep, perchance to dream. I there's the rub. For in that sleep of death, what dreams may come? When we have suffered off this, shuffled off this mortal coil, you know. I don't know um, must give us pause. There's the respect that makes long calamity of um, so long life. Who, for who would bear the whips and scorns in time, the oppressor's wrong, the proud man's contumely, the pain, the pangs of despise love, the law's delay, the insolence of office and the spurns, that patient merit of the unworthy takes, that when he might his quietus make with a bare bodkin? Who would fardels bear, to grunt and sweat under a weary life, but that the dread of the something after death, the undiscovered country from whose born no traveler returns, puzzles the will that makes us rather those ills rather bear those ills we have than fly to others we know not of? Thus conscious doth make cowards of us all, and is thus the native hue of resolution is sicklied o'er with pale cat with the pale cast of thought, and the enterprises of great pith and moment with this guard their currents turn awry, and Lose the name of action.
and it goes on from there when Ophelia shows up. So, like, like it's pretty clear, particularly considering that some of the phrases which have been introduced into common parlance, sorry for all the creaking from my chair, um, from Shakespeare, yeah, toy, um, the phrase that entered the common parlance from Shakespeare, numerous ones from uh, regarding death and suicide come from this. Shuffle off, shuffling off this mortal coil as euphemism for death. Uh, quietus is um, that ex um, in Children of Men that term is used for the uh, assisted suicide stuff from that. Um, that sort of thing. So, like, it's 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 not just about what do we do with the time we have. It's again, it's not to do at all with the time we have available. It's whether or not to choose to kill himself ourselves. But apparently, how that speech was localized into Japanese or translated in Japanese. Yeah, not just not just local, not just translated, but translated and localized into Japanese shifted the implication of the soliloquy to being not about whether to take one's own life, but rather what to do with our life or and the time we have in our life before we die. So I guess go either that or something really weird happened here with the localization of this line for game. I don't know, man. I don't know. All right. And it's also not often I get to do a quote Shakespeare on a on a stream. So hey, I will I will cut this game some slack for letting me talk about Shakespeare. So you know what? Hey, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the show, please like and subscribe. And also consider backing my Patreon. Patreon backers get episodes up to one week early of this show and any future Let's Plays. Also, please consider backing my coffee. Uh, toss me a few bucks also helps support the show and it's not a monthly obligation or anything like that.